Welcome everyone, and thank you for attending our X-Series webinar today. My name is BJ Nault, and I'm a technical sales representative here at MatchTech, and I will be one of your presenters today, along with Nina Vernali, who is our business development coordinator. I hope everyone is safe and doing well out there. We really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to join us for this short webinar on our new X-Series generation of data loggers. We are very excited to discuss these new devices with you, and hopefully you will find some of this information helpful. And to get things kicked off, I will pass it over to Nina to introduce herself and get things started. Thanks, BJ, and hello, everyone. Thank you for tuning in today. As mentioned, my name is Nina, and I work in business development here at MagTech. We have some great content to share with you today on our latest X-Series, so let's go ahead and get started. So first, we'd like to talk about the X-Series applications and how and where these loggers can be used. The whole series was built specifically to measure and record data of three different parameters, and this includes current, voltage, and temperature. So here are a few examples of the applications these loggers can be used in. For temperature applications, we offer two types of temperature-based loggers, the TC Temp X and RTD Temp X. Now these loggers can be used in just about every aspect of food processing and food production. If you have a drying or fermentation process, for example, and you need to meet regulatory requirements, either of these loggers can be used to provide you with accurate temperature readings that can be logged and stored at chosen intervals, which can save a significant amount of time, especially if you need to meet FDA or USDA requirements. In terms of stability chambers and autoclaves, these loggers can be used to monitor a high temperature validation process from start to finish and are ideal for monitoring multiple points in a central location as such. Since most chambers and autoclaves operate at such high temperatures, they do in fact run in cycles. And what's great about these loggers is that they have the ability to start recording data at custom start times and they are capable of real time recording, which is very beneficial if you are running multiple cycles per day which most hospitals, laboratories, and medical offices will typically do. Oven mapping is another great example of where these loggers can be utilized. If you look at the photo of the rotisserie chicken cooking, for example, you'd want to make sure that every chicken is cooked adequately and are all achieving the same temperature during the cooking process. Using the designated probe or probes, depending on how many channels you have enabled, you can not only measure the product's core temperature, but also the ambient temperature of the oven to ensure safe cooking temperatures have been achieved and will remain consistent throughout the entire process. Thanks, Nina. So now let's talk about some of our current applications for our current X data logger. One of these applications would be four to 20 milliamp current loops, such as a pressure transducer or any other device that has a four to 20 milliamp output. If you look at the picture uh, in the top right hand corner, it looks like we have a pressure transducer attached to the pipe right there. Another application would be food process control, such as monitoring machinery that has sensors that put out a four to 20 milliamp output to a three amp output. And another common application for current loggers would be flow meters, many of which have a four to 20 milliamp output, which can be used to calculate flow rate with the engineering units in our software. Now let's talk about voltage applications for our Voltex. This could be things such as power supply monitoring, where our multi-channel voltage loggers can be used to monitor multiple power supplies at the same time. Another application would be battery studies. Our Voltex logger can be very useful for solar panel and many other battery applications. And last, another application would be our in-circuit monitoring which allows you to monitor multiple points in a circuit at the same time, which can be very useful. Now, some of you may be familiar with our V2 series product line, and these loggers were available in four and eight channels. They required an IFC to connect to your computer, and they also had a notably smaller memory capacity. The new X series is actually taking place of these V2 loggers, and they will no longer be available to purchase. I would like to add that only these eight loggers are becoming obsolete and we will continue to manufacture and sell our V2 products that include the LCD screens on the front. Now this is every product in the newest X series and as you can see we did increase the amount of available channels. 
In addition to the four and eight channels we previously offered with the V2 series, we have added the options of 12 and 16 channels, which now gives the user four separate options to choose from. Not only do we increase the number of channels, but a major notable improvement to this X series is the increased memory rate. So for example, the Quad TC Temp V2 logger that was shown in the previous slide was capable of recording roughly 261,000 readings per channel, and that's with all channels enabled. And with the new four channel TC Temp X, which is the comparable model, memory reading has been increased to over 500,000 readings per channel. So these devices can hold a significantly greater amount of memory, which can make the user experience much easier and less time consuming. And now BJ is going to tell you a little bit more about the design features. Okay, so some design features of the X series. As stated before, it's available in four, eight, 12, and 16 channels, which doubles our previous capabilities. These devices are made of solid aluminum with strategic mounting holes and notches for easy mounting. There's an easy to read labeling uh, for probe configuration located right on top of the device. It comes with an excellent 18 month battery life and they also have the ability to connect to an external power source. This power source does come with the logger when you purchase it. There's no interface cable that is required for purchase. There is a simple cable, a USB to micro USB cable that comes with purchase of the logger for connecting it to a computer. The X series loggers have up to a four Hertz reading rate. They have push button or programmable start options available. With solid state memory, these loggers can hold between two to four million readings. They also have the ability to disable or enable channels to maximize this memory capacity. And last, they can also be connected to a computer while running for real-time readings as well. So let's talk about some of the individual units. The first one that we will talk about is the TC Temp X and some of the key features. The body of the logger has an operating environment of negative 20 C to 60 C. It accepts all the common thermal couple types like J, K, T, and many others. It connects to the logger with mini plug connectors right into the side of the logger. The TC Temp X has automatic cold junction compensation available for each channel as well. This provides four, eight, 12, or 16 ambient temperature channels and aids in a fast response time and high accuracy. The ambient channels can be disabled in the software if not desired, and the device has a memory of up to two plus million readings. Our second temperature logger is the RTD Temp X series. These loggers record temperatures from minus 200 Celsius to 850 degrees with a calibration accuracy of plus or minus 0.15 ohms at 25 degrees Celsius and they do accept two, three, and four wire RTDs. The RTD Temp X is going to be a bit more accurate in its readings in comparison to the TC Temp X. However, as stated, the maximum RTD temperature range is 850 degrees C. And in comparison, some thermocouple types can reach temperatures well over 1000 degrees. So when you're choosing a logger, it's really about what temperature parameters fit your application best and how you're going to be utilizing them. If you are looking for more information in regards to parameters or looking to compare either models, they can be found right on the data sheet of the product pages on our website. This is our current X series. They are low level DC current data loggers and are available in three ranges, 30 milliamps, 160 milliamps, and three amps. They provide an accuracy of up to 0.16 milliamps and they offer memory capacity of up to 4 million readings and are channel dependent. These loggers will accept current signals from sensors, transducers, and many other common current sources. And I will reiterate that these are DC direct current loggers only. Okay, so some key features of the Voltex. Uh, the Voltex reads and records DC voltage. It's available in three ranges, 160 millivolts, 3.2 volts, and 32 volts. There's 24-bit readings for high resolution. Range dependent, it has an accuracy of plus or minus 0.032 millivolts. The Volt X has a memory of 2.7 plus million readings. 
Also, this logger works really well with our programmable engineering units in our MagTech 4 software. In addition worth mentioning to this series is that the 4 and 8 channel TC Temp X loggers are compatible with our Thermovault system. For those of you who are unfamiliar with our Thermovault system, this is a thermal insulated thermocouple based temperature logging system and it can withstand temperatures up to 350 degrees C for up to 25 minutes when it's properly sealed. And included in this system are Type-K thermocouples as well as a power supply. The stainless steel enclosure and external thermocouples prov will provide you with accurate temperature measurements and fast response times. And this system is compatible with the latest MagTech 4 software. A few application examples where the system could be used in include oven profiling, HASP implementation, and extreme temperature monitoring. The Thermovault is a really great product if you are looking to measure high temperatures for a certain period of time. Okay, so our MagTech 4 software. Let's talk about some of the key features to our software. One key feature is the engineering units feature. This feature is very popular with our current and voltage data loggers. It lets you convert native current or voltage signals to things like temperature, pressure, or humidity. Another thing with our software is you can easily create reports. We have three main report types. We have a graph, a data table, and a statistics report. A key feature in the statistic report is it uh, allows you to offer helpful things like min, max, and average. And all three reports are exportable to Excel. Also in our software, you can rename channels for simple identification. And our MagTech 4 software is a free download from our website. And for our customers that may need aiding in the compliance of 21 CFR Part 11, we also offer a secure software package that's available for purchase. And that concludes our presentation for today. Now would be a great time to answer any questions that you may have for us. Um, we have a question from Lindsay Ryan and she said, do you plan on creating thermal vaults for the 12 and 16 channel loggers? Great question. So right now we currently have it available in the four and eight channel, but we do plan on making the thermal volts available in the 12 and 16 channel loggers uh, in the near future. Oh, it looks like we have another question from Ryan Culp. Does Magitech sell RTD for the RTDX logger? Good question, Ryan. Yes, Ryan, we do have some RTDs available on our website. Um, if you hover over the products tab, and then there's a tab for RTDs. You'll see a selection of RTDs that we have available for you. I think that's it. Thanks again, everyone, and have a great rest of your day. Oh, it looks like we have another question. <laughs> Sorry, there's some popping up from Virginia. Um, does MagTech have a system for lab-wide temperature monitoring systems? Hi, Virginia, great question. Yes, we have systems available. Um, it'd be nice probably if you want to take it offline, if you want to email us at info at magtech.com and tell us a little bit more about what types of devices that you want to monitor, we can definitely make some recommendation on some loggers for a lab system for you. So that concludes our webinar for today. Thank you everyone for joining us. If you'd like to learn more about our X series, all products are listed on our website at magtech.com. If you have any further questions on specifications or which logger would be most suitable for your application, feel free to give us a call or email us at info at or sales at magtech.com and we would be more than happy to speak with you and help you out. Thank you again and have a great rest of your day.